All right, gentlemen, you both received your instructions in the dressing room. You obey the commands to protect yourselves at all time. Right now, under the letters here. Right now, under the letters here. Top it up. Let's go to work. Hey, Timmy and Dre, let me just say this. There is a Loma chance that has already gone up a couple times here at Madison Square Garden. Now, this is a fighter from Ukraine. This is a fighter who the three of us have traveled the world broadcasting his fights, right? We were in London, yep. packed house there firm against Luke Campbell. We went on the West Coast to L.A., Vegas. This is the fifth time at MSG. But you look throughout this packed Madison Square Garden, you will see the yellow and blue Ukrainian flags, and there is a wave of support for Loma. Opening round here against Comey. Dre, you made the point earlier tonight, in terms of Comey, got to be more than just the right hand footwork, and especially against the expert of the footwork of Lomachenko, footwork is critical. He's got a box, he's got to use his jab, he's got to feint, he's got to almost be a mirror of what Lomachenko is trying to do to him. He can't just sit there and wait for the right hand because he'll never land it. You look at Loma right now, that's what he's doing. He's processing, he's downloading, he's trying to figure out what range, okay, what is Comey trying to do, how close do I need to get, and then all of a sudden he starts to open up in that third or fourth round. Comey can't let that happen. Loma will almost lull opponents to sleep with what he does in the first two rounds. And they'll say, well, he's not as bad as I thought he was. He's not as, as good as they said he was. And then all of a sudden, he turns it on. Now, you've always described it as downloading, that computer system of understanding range and distance and how angular he's capable of being against an opponent. Well, I asked him, I said, how long does it take you to figure out a guy and an opponent? He says, two rounds. That's all I need, two rounds to figure him out. Now, the great criticism in terms of starting a little slow, it wasn't downloading, it was purposeful, was in the upset against Teofimo Lopez, Dre, where people were saying, what is he doing? He's giving away the first six rounds. He did that because he didn't have confidence that his right shoulder could hold up, and he said, I'll just give it a go halfway through. It was too little too late. I'm not sure I fully believe that, and I've, I've, I've stated this this whole time. I think that it was the speed, the accuracy, the power of Teofimo Lopez that had Loma hesitant because you got to realize Loma's a, a competitor. He's a winner. Winners don't just give up six rounds. There's a reason he wasn't throwing that left hand, and then he started to throw it in the back half of the fight down the stretch. Now, Comey has power, short right hand on the inside. He's well above the lightweight averages Comey typically. He throws 67 and a half punches per round on average. That was a great move by Comey, stepping around. As soon as Loma got her on that angle, he stepped around with him. He took his back leg and spent around with him. There exactly he is what again. we talked about, right? Understanding that you have to apply the mirrored footwork. Nice body work right there. Comey goes Good to shot, the body. Comey. Wasn't a hard shot. He just tossed it and he threw it in the right, in the right spot at the right time. Left hand comes in from Loma. <laughs> Limited offensive output from both men in that first round. Comey threw more punches, threw 37 total punches is the final tally, landing only four. Loma Watch was six hands. of 18. Mark it out. Hands are free. Bert, step back. I got it. Stop. Stop. Comey's doing a good job in keeping distance outside, and he's playing for the outside position, the L position on Lomachenko. But I like his patience. It's going to be about timing for him. He has to time Lomachenko on the way in with his right hand. See that move right there from Loma. He didn't throw a punch, but that took wind from Comey. That made him take a deep breath in because he thought that Loma was going to be there and then all of a sudden he wasn't. And then Loma came back and then he wasn't. That starts to drain you psychologically and physically. Ooh. Good work on the inside. Both men able to land shots there. Did you see them body work from punches up, punches up. from Comey? That's the key right there. When you have a small guy in front of you and a quick guy, you want to go down to his body. 
Three times he's been able to land body punches here early on. There is a left hand to the body. And see the angles of Lomachenko as he gets around to the right. Now Comey meets him in the kitchen. Even though Loma landed that shot, I like the poise from Comey. And I like the fact that he had his hands up. And when Loma made the turn, he made the turn with his hands up. So Loma couldn't follow up with a head shot. And to stop that turn of Loma, that front foot step shuffle, you got to throw your left hook. Hands are free. Work out. Comey Work should out. let his Work left out. hook go. Made left hand from Lomachenko moments ago. Andre Rogier, the trainer for Richard Comey, has been stressing, Ooh. keeping those hands up. There's the lead left again. Ooh. Then he goes to the body. Sharp shooting now. You saw the left hook right there thrown by Comey, but he threw it too high. He needs to throw it at the shoulder. Just like he did there. Good shot right there. Richard Comey. I got you. I got you. Step back. Good. You throw it at the shoulder just in case Lomachenko dips underneath it like that. And you can meet his chin. Comey also has to stay poised with some of those movements. Don't get discouraged. That's also where Loma gets fighters. They get discouraged, then they start to get hit, and then they start to get beat up, and they try to figure out what happened. He needs to stay po poised and composed even when Loma has a good moment or, or steps to the side like that, just turn with them and stay calm. And forget, the, and forget about the head of Lomachenko. Go to the body. That's where Comey's having success. Woo! Look at that from Lomachenko! <laughs> he said, you go back to your corner after that. Andre Ward Lomachenko landed 12 power punches in that second round, including that attention-grabbing left hand. Look at this. Yeah, and they were all flush. You start to see the counter right there. He lands a shot, he grazes it, but then he follows up with an overhand left that Comey felt. And this starts to happen all of a sudden in the second and third round. The opponents start to realize, well, how's he reaching me? Comey has a five and a half inch reach advantage, but then he, he does the psychological game. Hey, you, you, you go right there. Go back to your corner. I'll see you next round. <laughs> As we said earlier, you bring up the height and reach advantage that Comey has. Listen, Lomachenko is not a natural lightweight. This is a guy that first won a title at 126 pounds. He's a little guy. He just wanted the challenge. He's fighting his seventh consecutive opponent who has the height and reach advantage. Comey has to put those bad moments, those, those sequences that Loma would produce but in the back of his mind immediately. He's got to have a short memory, and he has to go right back to work and stick to the game plan. Can't dwell on it. I know Loma. I know Loma's a, Loma's a smaller man, but you got to understand Loma. That's, that's wrestling tactics right there. That's what he's using. You got to understand that's a, Loma's background right there. He has taken up wrestling. Hey, Bernardo, what are they saying in the corner of Richard Comey right now? They want him to concentrate on working the body of Lomachenko, but they want him to, more than anything, make it physical, wrestle with him, make him work. Well, he has landed seven body shots against Loma to this point. There it is. Loma already won the, the foot position go. battle. He's already working those work angles out. on Comey. So Comey, right, he has to make it rough and tough for Loma by pressuring him. That's it. Good job with the short chopping left hands from Comey. I like how Comey inside, he's not looking for any particular punch or to land any particular place. He's just throwing, and when he does that, he's had success. You're absolutely right. That has been his best. But just as Comey's working, and he's exerting energy. You gotta, you gotta watch the comeback. And here comes Loma. As he took that step to the right, three punch combination. They all land clean. There it is again. Incredible footwork. Olay. Well, remember, Dad said, "Hey, you're gonna stop boxing as a kid. You're gonna do Ukrainian Ooh. national dance. That's the foundation to his footwork." Oh, oh, what a shot! Right on the chin and the combination. Comey stands up to it and fires back. Oh, we got good stuff at MSG tonight, folks. Punch of the Night is brought to you by Boost Mobile.
And Tim Bradley, you say Keyshawn Davis is the future of the sport. The body shot knockout of Jose Zaragoza. Ooh that's a nasty shot right there. Zaragoza gonna feel that tomorrow, the next day, and the next day, and the next day. Silver medalist from Team USA, now 4-0 with three knockouts, a rising star in boxing he was on earlier tonight. And then just moments ago in round three, we saw this snap of the head back by Lomachenko. Yeah, Comey went to the, to the well too often. He threw the right hand, just throwing it out there, trying to hit Loma. Watch Loma timed him, got his head off the line, boom. Slot change, left hand straight down the middle. I think the best shot that Comey has in this fight is to get his jab moving, to try to press Lomachenko back. He's going to get hit, but try to block and cover up as much as you can, and then you got to fire. You just got to fire anywhere to try to land on the body, to the head. You can't, you know, I said earlier in the fight, he's got to try to box with Loma. It's just too hard. Loma has too much experience, and his, his IQ is just too in-depth. It's not going to happen tonight. Comey has to try to push Loma back. I got you. Good, good. Uh, I, I, Comey got to find a way to cut that foot outside, that lead foot outside of Loma. Loma's winning that battle. He's up. Loma's not just beating up the body, he's discouraging the mind at all times with his movements and the type of punches that he lands. What punches he shouldn't land, that's what discourages an opponent. And it's crazy how he gets in range, taking out of range to get back in range and hit you with shots like that. And then finishes downstairs. That was a left hand to the body that finished that combination. And good work by Coleman to fire back. Trying to split the guard with a right hand of his own. Back to that southpaw jab. Little uppercut on the inside, goes back to it. Sometimes he just probes with punches and then changes up the speed and then brings the power. Just manipulating yeah, the trying to open me up. So he's trying to is. open Comey up. That's all he's trying to do. Ooh. But Loma better be careful because Comey, good shot right there from Loma. Comey's covering up and he's waiting for Loma to pull back and then he's trying to counter him. That was masterful work with the body punch combination, then went up top. Loma's in gear right now. Comey looks like he's breaking down rapidly right in front of our eyes right now. Comey looks over to his corner for just a moment, and they said circle, circle, circle. Do something different. I just can't help but notice the body attack of Loma. Left hand down to the body. Occasional jabs down to the body. That's what's weakening Comey. Back here at Madison Square Garden with Silly Lomachenko wants to prove himself against the former champion Richard Comey tonight and stay the course for his quest to try to get the belts back. Goal is to be undisputed, he says, at 135 pounds. Mm. 41 to 25 power punch connect advantage. You see the percent to the body. As Comey has had some limited success there. Loma has been bashful about banging that body as well. Look, Loma banging the body, also making Comey miss. Siphon the gas tank of Richard Comey, and plus all the feints he's doing too. You gotta, you gotta take that into account as well. That keeps a fighter tense. You're constantly burning energy, sitting there taking all those feints on. Comey's gotta be very careful to not become a spectator at his own fight. He can start point. to look at Loma. Good, 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 good. Yes, he can start to look at Loma and all the things that he's doing and without even realizing it, become okay, a spectator. Okay. He's got to stick to the game plan. And Andre Rogier, the trainer of Richard Comey, has to keep him mentally engaged with the game plan. Go on, Richard. Let him go, Richard. Let him go, Richard. 
<laughs> nice shot right Good there. Good shot. See the hand speed right there. Speed kills. And that first step, that Loma has is extremely explosive. Best thing Comey has done tonight was hit to the body. Clean sweep on Andre's scorecard. Four rounds to zip. And Loma's feeling those body shots. Yes, he is. Just not showing it. See how Loma getting himself, getting himself outside in that L position. You see the legs get tangled a bit. That's the reason why you want to do that. That's the weaker side of the Orthodox fighter. You lose them when you go in that position. There it is. Bye. Where are you? Just circled around him. <laughs> Beautiful footwork right there. Front foot step shuffle. End of five, Loma in control. He has shown us a bit of everything tonight, Andre, but we often focus in on the elite footwork. Yeah, for, before Lomachenko, before it's a battle of the, the hands, it's a battle of the feet. Look at this, no punch thrown, but, well, those punches were thrown, but he's stepping around. And he's, he's not a stationary target, so the opponent gets hit, then he's gotta find Loma. Then he gets hit again, then he's gotta find Loma. That drains you mentally and physically, and then you start getting hit with clean shots. You start to feel demoralized, then you start to get hurt, and then you start to get, you start having problems, and that's the that's the, the range that, you know, Comey's getting into right now, where the flush shots of Lomachenko are starting to land more and more, and Loma's gonna start to put twos and threes together, and if Comey can't answer that, it's gonna spell trouble for Comey. See, this is the sweet science. You know, what you're seeing from Lomachenko is hit and don't get hit, and you always wanna put yourself in a position to where you can't get hit back. He's okay. doing the hitting, and okay. then when he angles out front foot step shuffle, or back foot step shuffle, he's getting around you and losing his opponent, and not allow him to come back with any offense. So I'm getting his final instructions there from Anatoly Lomachenko, affectionately known as Papa Chanko's 56-year-old father, who has been named the trainer of the year two times in his career, former kickboxer who started his son in boxing at four years old. At four years old, he was putting him in a stance <laughs> and teaching him how to throw punches with balance and work on the footwork. Okay, the imagine. footwork is working so well against Comey because Comey doesn't have the best feet. He needs you kind of stationary to land his big punch. And every time he gets ready to throw, Loma will move to the side, the left or the right, and it'll make Comey reset. And it's just been frustrating for Comey all night long, but he has to once again put that behind him and keep chopping, keep jabbing, keep trying to get some shots off to give him to give himself a, a chance in this fight. Now the chance can often come from the right hand of Richard Comey. 30 wins, yes. 27 knockouts. You cannot deny the power that he possesses. 82% knockout rate. Comey has resulted to plan C. Attack Lomachenko, go down to the body, put as much pressure as you can on him. Keep your hands high, cover up, and land when you can. That was a nice right uppercut that got into the mix of that exchange. Comey can't let Loma win this exchange. This is where Comey wants him, so he's got to take full advantage. Well, if he's at mid-range, Lomachenko got the quicker hands and the shorter hands, so they can get off a lot quicker. I'm talking about inside. Oh, yeah, inside. The shorter, smaller man is going to have the advantage. Lomachenko's smart, and he got the short hands to go along with it. Comey needs to catch him on the way in. And Loma doesn't defend very well to the body. He'll give up good body shots. Ooh, that like one right there. This is also part of the draining process. He doesn't allow, and I'm talking about Loma, he doesn't allow his opponents to rest inside. They think he's small, but then they feel him, 
the physical strength, he's stronger than what they realize, and he's always wrestling and tussling so they don't get a chance to get a breather. He wasn't always like that. He wasn't always like that. Loma wasn't physical like he is now. That just shows you how much he's learned from his losses. Homie has to just keep punching. It just takes one. Fight your way out to the clinching, boys. Fight your way Joe out to the Joe Timmons Ray back with you ringside right here at Madison Square Garden. Punches up. Vasily Lomachenko with an 88 to 36 connect advantage. Richard Comey has landed 21 body punches. And Dre, after that last round, Andre Rogier, his trainer, veteran trainer, said the pressure with the body shots, it'll get to him. But you have to commit to it. And that's something you're talking yeah, about, yeah, how mentally right. taxing and exhausting it can be going up against Lomachenko. You must stay the course. You have to stay with the strategy. He's got that exactly. I mean, everybody has a plan against Lomachenko until they get in there. And when all of, they start to see all these different movements and all the all of his matrix like tactics, they so a lot of guys just get bewildered and they, they get beat mentally before they get beat physically. Doesn't seem to be the case with Comey right now, but Andre Rogier gave him the right instruction. Back him up, keep digging to the bottom oh! because oh. Sensational from Loma. Okay. Tagged him with the left. And now he's pointing to his corner. He's pointing to Comey's corner and saying, you want me to give him more or do you want to stop this? Comey's not good. Left hand comes in. Loma ready to close the show. He told the corner what he's going to do to their fighter. Let's see if he can do it. Comey's holding on. Former As lightweight should. champion himself. Now just trying to survive the former number one pound for pound best in the world. Lomachenko gives it a look at the legs of Comey. He can barely stand up. Lomachenko's oh telling the oh corner of Comey, you should stop this. Lomachenko to the inside. Digging to the body, oh, and Comey right, ties stop, up. Stop, 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 Instincts stop, stop. take over, trying to survive. Tough fighter from Ghana. So prideful. Can get you knocked out. It can. Can be too tough for your own good sometimes. Uppercut lands, wobbles Comey, batters him upstairs. Raining in shots on both levels is Lomachenko. Comey finds the strength to punch back. Sweeping right hand misses, and Loma lands a left again. Comey firing an uppercut. So game to stay right there in the heat of the battle while being beaten down by Lomachenko. Dominating round by the silly Lomachenko. How you feel? Put your head over there. Put the puppy on there. Richard, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Richard, are you okay? Yeah. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Come on. You okay? Yeah, yeah. You're in the fight? Yeah. All right. Richie, listen to me. You made the same mistake I asked you not to do. Yeah. Don't let him lay on shots. Yes, yes, yeah, you yes. stay there when he keeps falling on. Right. Tie him up or move. If I see you getting hurt like that again, I'm going to stop this. How do you feel, man? Look, you gotta put pressure on this kid. If you back Look up, he's going to that corner. I gotta check him out, all right? This is unreal. Beautiful left hand right there. Richard Comey is a bit bewildered right here. Against the ropes. Nice, short, crisp right hand. Right over the top, right on the chin. You, over Boom, short impact. Right on the chin, and down goes Richard Comey. 
Ringside physicians now, looking over now. Richard Comey. Now, the humility Ooh. that Lomachenko showed in trying to get the corner to stop the match was unreal. I've never seen that before. Eighth round here. Let's see what Comey's legs look like. Dre, how does he look to you? He's back more than he was, but he's not all the way back. And Loma's just looking for that one good shot, and I think he's going to get it. Loma Chant rises up here in New York again. Told you, many Ukrainian fans here. Ukrainian flag seen throughout Madison Square Garden. To root for the two-time Olympic gold medals. See, anytime you have a puncher like Comey, a lot of the times, a coach won't stop a match because as long as he has his legs underneath him and he seems to still have some power, he always has a chance. He's looking for the one good shot. He's looking for that left hand, isn't he? Yes, sir. He get him. A, he trying to open, get him to open up right now. Those small shots right there is to get Comey to open up with something wide so he can counter right over the top with something. See if Comey reaches with the right hand. That's exactly what he's looking if for. If Comey reaches with the right hand, he's going to fill that gap. Try to get under that elbow to the body. He has scored sensational knockdowns before with body shots. Lomachenko just wanted to see what Comey was going to do. Slipped in, stayed low, watched him. He wasn't going to do anything. He go back out and reset. Yeah, he's in total control right now. He knows what he's doing. He's just looking to. It's almost a clash of heads there. I think it was. It was. Just trying to get Comey to open up, make a mistake so then he can make him pay. Looking for that left hand. Left hand landed flush. Okay, we're out. Ten seconds. Let's go. Hey! No punch. Watch your head. Fellas, this is the typical Lomachenko fight. He's giving away size, but it's the shots you don't see that disorient you and defeat you and you don't see him because no one moves like him no one has this assortment of angles and punches and no one has the skill or the imagination and mark as we begin round number nine here Vasily Lomachenko according to CompuBox has a 138 to 44 advantage as Richard Comey in his game he survived that seventh round where 36 punches were landed against him in that seventh round. That's the most by any Comey opponent in his career. Comey is biting down right now. Mm -hmm. Still trying to win this fight. I wouldn't expect anything else from Richard Comey. Angles, space, touching, changing up speeds is Loma again. I think Loma's laying the trap, fellas. It, it's looked that way for about a round and a half, Dre, hasn't it? He's trying. I think he took. He, I think he took the last round off, and also wanted to, you know, poke and prod and see what he could see. And he's doing the same thing now. He's not. He's way up on the scorecard, so he doesn't mind if Comey has a moment. He wants him to feel so comfortable that he opens up and he can land the shot that ends the night. There's no rush for Loma at this point. It's gonna be a left hand. Nice level change right there. Ooh. Ten eight round was the seventh round. That was the okay. knockdown.
you guys wondering what's going on right now. That's what's going on. Loma's just looking for an opportunity to land the kill shot, which is the left hand. Andre Rozier's biggest concern is that Richard Comey's not circling to his left. He's standing right in front of Lomachenko, and that's where Loma's doing the most damage. It's worth noting Comey's bravery. We've seen guys hurt by Lomachenko before, and they don't come back. He's made a show of, he's made a show of his heart. I mean, there was the stretch when we were calling him no Moschenko, as four consecutive opponents said no Moss in the ring against him and just quit on the stool, didn't want to continue. Landscape at 135 pounds has dramatically changed. George Cambosis had the upset over Teofimo Lopez. He has four belts. You got Debbie, Devin Haney out there. You got Tank Davis out there. And then there's Lomachenko, who, Tim Bradley, you say, I understand Cambosis has both belts, but I feel like I know who the best at 135 pounds is. Yeah, we're watching him right now. Lomachenko, without question, if you can get past this. You know, this fight's still not over. You're in there with a puncher. It's to the end. Oh, we tried. Just missed a right hand. Just missed two right hands. See, what you're seeing from Comey is desperation. He's trying to do anything he can to land his right hand and to win this fight. You see Loma, he's taking his time. He, uh, he still feels the power of Comey. He still feels it in that right hand. So he's being cautious. You're wondering why you're seeing some lows from Loma. He's trying to set it up. He can't, he can't afford to get complacent. Comey answer with a right hand. Good answer from Comey. That's where Loma needs to go, right there. Down to that body. Thudding shots from Lomachenko. Mm. Nice hook right there from, from Comey. Get that Trying body to, shot get, get through. Trying to punch where Loma's, where he thinks he's going to be, or where he's moving to. Comey's had brief moments, just that Loma steals the play shortly after. Mm. Comey's still dangerous. Still got those heavy hands. And he still seems to have some energy. Told us he's fighting shot, inspired tonight. He's got his wife here in the U.S. Seeing him ringside for the first time. Nice little short hook right there from Loma. Moving outside. End of 10 here at Madison Square Garden. That guy's got three heavyweight belts. Alexander Usyk, number four pound for pound. One of the very best fighters in the world. Beat Anthony Joshua. And just before this main event, when Tyson Fury was here, they had a photo op with Bob Arum. Nice. <laughs> so maybe down the road, we will see that for an undisputed heavyweight championship. We we'll talk about skill. It. And obviously a dear and loyal stablemate and friend of Vasily Lomachenko. Usyk was in the production meeting with him and with us yesterday talking about all their times together, and how hard Lomachenko works to the end. Always pushing himself past the limit as he describes it. Guy who holds his breath underwater to challenge himself, not just physically, but mentally, 
for four and a half minutes. Broke his record. Previous record was what, 428? That's right. 430 this count. Round number 11. 188 to 58 connect advantage for Lomachenko. Had Comey hurt badly in the seventh round. Just shows you what type of heart that Comey has. What he has built up inside. I mean, he's back into this fight right now. He's not winning this fight, but he seems very stable and more than capable of pulling off something in these next few rounds. Not saying that he right will. From Loma right there. Beautiful movement. Angles from Loma. Well, Machenko's just giving Comey too many looks. He just can't keep up. He can't keep up. It's too much that Comey has to deal with mentally in this fight for him to even be able to get some momentum and get going. Every time Comey makes one adjustment, Loma makes two more adjustments. Here has been saying, Comey, just box, be smart. And other members of the team are yelling, he's got to fight, you've got to fight him. Mm. And in the end, Rogier says, no, he's got to be smart. Eight piece for all your troubles. I got you. Don't punch. Those bursts of accuracy, those bursts of work rate, it's ended 44% of his total punches. And changing up levels. Mid goes up, finishes to the body. And the tempo. Yeah. You know, he'll speed him up, slow him down, then boom, come with a big shot. That hurts. Left hand to the body. And look at Comey. He hears the clap and he fires off. Guy's got heart. Yes, he does. Okay. Whenever Richard Comey falls asleep, you see Loma just come back six, seven, eight, eight shots unanswered. Unanswered is the operative word. You get hit with those kind of shots, you gotta answer. And when Loma gets off like that and Comey has no answer, it, again, it's just, it's discouraging, it's demoralizing. And you know what the judges are looking at. Even if Comey had some good moments early in the round, that round is going to Lomachenko. All right? And don't reach for them body shots. Sit down on them. Rich, if he's going to throw five, get five with him. Okay, be smart. Nope. Step up. Step up. Good job. Going back. Both in final round as they touch them up. As Lomachenko has said, this fight, the next step to my goal. Goal is to be undisputed world champion. He was oh so close. Fought Teofimo Lopez with that opportunity. And now this division, far more interesting today than it was just a month ago. Wow. Beautiful footwork. Call me shook his head like, man, how do you do that? Both fighters are trying to do something big in this last round.
good answer from Comey right there. Ooh, some big shots coming from Comey. Right. Still in the 12th round. Loma still got to be careful. Loma just landed a left hand to the body and then goes with the right hand underneath that left elbow back to the body. So three to the body with the right hand still in play for Comey. There's a left hand upstairs from Lomachenko. Lomachenko wants Comey thinking downstairs so he can go upstairs and land a flush shot to the head. Mm, those body shots, those body shots are vicious. Aren't they? From Loma. You see what they do. See Comey standing still now, trying to brace himself for the body shots coming from Lomachenko. So left coming upstairs within this last, this next minute, fellas. I think he'll set it up to the body or faint to the body, then come upstairs. Yeah, I think that's yeah. what he's doing. He's had yeah. success down low, so he's gonna try up top one more time. I'm asking for the uppercut from Comey. Sit, wait, when he attacks, shoot that uppercut, especially when he goes down to the body. I got you, I got you, okay? Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Let's go. Last half minute. You think about where we were in the seventh round and give credit to Richard Comey in his corner. But the skill, the will. The class of the silly Lomachenko. It has been evident all night long. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, after 12 rounds of world class boxing, how about a round of applause for these two incredible lightweight warriors? Now, after 12 rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for the official decision. Tony Paolillo has the bout 117-110. Eric Marlinski and Tom Schreck both score the bout 119-108 for your winner by unanimous decision. And now the WBO Intercontinental Lightweight Champion, Vasily Loma! Lomachenko! Lomachenko did it his way on his terms. Started doing the damage early on. Had the big left hand in the second round. Had the one that snapped back the head in the third round and then really hurt Comey in that seventh round, Mark Regal. Me did something most guys could not survive. Lomachenko will always come up against